Hello there guys, welcome to this next episode. Uh, previously in this gameplay we just managed to beat Tramir 2-1 in the Vans Trophy. We also managed to beat Berry and Huddersfield, uh, which isn't a bad run of results, which leaves us just about in the playoffs. We're pretty much on the same amount of points as Cardiff and Bristol City, one point ahead of Wickham and Port Vale as well. So it is incredibly close just to get into the playoff positions at the minute. Uh, we start this gameplay with a trip to Swindon. We don't have our first choice goalkeeper ready today, so this is going to be interesting. So, I keep forgetting I've changed this formation, haven't I, a bit? So, if we said the centre-backs, uh, Hughes and Reed, wasn't it? They were the two centre-backs. Uh, we had Hills and Duff on the wing. A defensive mid was Strachan. Bullock was key. McLeod was key. And I think Richie Wellens... Oh no, we had an attack in midfield, didn't we? <clears throat> I do wonder if that's... Oh yeah, because we were talking about Ormerod going in that position. Oh no. Let's try Clarks in that position. And let's have Ormerod and Madeira up front. This does actually leave open a possibility for him to, to possibly go on the market, maybe. Should we try and... I think there was a lot of people who said get rid of this guy. So I'm going to put him on the transfer list and hopefully he brings in some money. We don't have a substitute keeper today, which is a bit of an issue, but we'll see how we get on. 94 Madeira. Um, let's give Madeira a rest and let's put Fenton on instead of him. Okay, um, tricky game. Always tricky, like I said, in these games. Any away game in this league. Um, we find tricky. Um, yeah, one nil down already. It just seems to be a bit of a a consistency based problem that we've got. Because I mean, you can see that we've just won in the Vans Trophy. And we won the previous two games in the league. Yeah, we're getting yeah we're beat here. <clears throat> and Swindon aren't even around. They're about thirteenth after they've got these three points. Yeah, we're dropping out of those playoff positions now as well. Which is incredibly disappointing. I don't know whether having an attacking midfield is the right way to go, right way to go about things. I might. Hmm. I might shove Clarkson back here, you know. Let's see how he gets on there. And pushes on. I mean, I know I'm not playing Madeira. Obviously, he's our he's our best striker by a mile, but it is what it is. Yep, see, he's, he's um, transfer listed already. So we'll put Madeira in for the next game, the home game against Chesterfield's very very important. Uh, we've got a win, and then we've got Port Vale in the semis of the Vans Trophy. I forgot how well we were doing in this in this cup, by the way. Hopefully, we can get somewhere, but I think. Port Vale was quite a tricky game. They've got McPhee, haven't they, up front? He seems to be a bit of a, a target man for them. And I think he's got a few goals this season. I'm sure I remember looking at it last time we played this game. But either way, we've got to just prove that we can do things. I mean, it doesn't help that our first choice keeper is obviously suspended. We have got a few people coming in, which is good. All these guys are coming in at the minute. So some, there's some really good players coming in, actually. So I'm, I'm quite looking forward to to that period when we can actually get them in uh, it'd be amazing but that's not going to be till next season so we have to try our best to try and get promotion this time around and hopefully those players will contribute towards next season in a positive way but okay Chesterfield are 14th we'll give it another go I'm going to keep this position let's, let's believe in this formation let's believe in these tactics shall we Okay, I don't believe in them anymore. Jesus, there we go, Madeira's back. Who's this? Oh, God, I thought that was one of ours. I'm getting a red. The amount, I've played this game quite a bit, not with this game, not with this gameplay, so I've played like with other leagues whilst I've been doing this series. And the amount of times I've had red cards that's just ruined games have been unbelievable. So I, I, my heart did go in my mouth then, thinking what on earth is going on. Oh, God, oh, bloody hell. Right, we need we need to win this game, and then I might probably put 
yeah, I'll prob- I'm not going to put a good team out there. Especially when we've got QPR coming up at home soon after. But we need to get this win now. This is really important. We just need to keep attacking. Come on, there we go. Ball. Oh, that's two goals disallowed now. We're not going to get it, are we? So we would have had two goals disallowed. And we drop points. That, this game drives me insane. Madeira played a 10. I feel so sorry for the guy. It's awful, man. It's just... Uh, that's why I don't think we're going to go up. I don't think we've got the consistency to um, to achieve it this year. But with those signings that we've brought in, if we're in Division 2 next year, I think we will go up. Right. Let me just have a look. and Oh, God. Strack and fitness worry. Yikes. Okay, he's definitely coming out. We'll put O'Connor in there. Oh, no, we won't. So what we'll do. We'll put O'Kane in. He's sat there. He's been quite good. Right, Clarkson. Out you get. Go on, Richardson. Let's see what you can do in this situation here. To be fair, we're, we're pretty fit. And West Brom are still interested in... I'm going to play Blinkhorn in this game, then. Let's see how he gets on. We'll give Matty Blinkhorn a game. 1-0. <coughs> Bloody hell. Who knows, maybe there is still hope for this competition. And there isn't. There we go, McPhee. Just like I said before. Right on cue. How many have they got here for this game? Four thousand. It's not bad for a Vans Trophy game. It isn't bad at all, actually. It's a good bit of income for a game like this. Do, 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 do. There we go, Richardson with the goal. Where's that come from? I am going to have to start bringing a few players off, though. We've got to be prepared for... Um, for Queen's Park Rangers. See, he's a fitness warrior as well. And I need O'Kane fit. Yeesh. <coughs> Bring which rich witchy? Bring Richie Wellens on. I'm going to bring Madeira off now as well. Let's bring Fenton on. He's actually not playing that good, Madeira. He's playing a six today, which is quite surprising for him. Um, I'm going to bring Blinkhorn off as well. May I don't know. The striker seems to be quite quiet today. I, I really did think Blinkhorn would take his chance, but that's a big win. I'm happy with that win. Okay, yeah, the pleased. I'm I'm actually incredibly pleased with that result. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this off because I need to think carefully now because Barnes is back as well uh, for this QPR game. But I'm just going to quickly do this draw. Is there a draw now? I don't even know if there is a draw. Do we just get put into this? I, I mean, it's it's us and Chesterfield. Who's in the southern? Southern, you got Luton and Bournemouth. It's doable. It's doable. I mean, I think we'll just have to wait and see what happens here. I don't really know. So we must play. Do we? I don't even know how this works. All right, so we play Chesterfield. Okay. The first leg. So it's two legs, which is quite handy. So the first leg is here. This is quite nice. I've never really got this far. And then the southern teams, Luton and Bournemouth. And then we play the winner of those, don't we? I'm sure that's how it used to work back in the day. Uh, anyway, guys, I'm going to leave it there. It, it wasn't too bad. Obviously, the defeat to Swindon was a bit of a nightmare. Uh, Chesterfield was frustrating. But the Vans Trophy semi-final win was a positive. It sets us up nicely for this QPR game. And then Port Vale away. To be honest with you, I would have rather have beaten Port Vale in the league than the Vans Trophy. Um, but... Hopefully we can get something there as well. Anyway, guys, please remember to hit that like button, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys later.